It was this is hard pass, Kyle. Oh, yeah. This is hard pass. That's I'm going to give it up. So, yeah. Louisiana Fest happened. Yeah. Shout out to Wayne. I got to say, the man. Goat. The GOAT. That's one of those things that uh, if we ever make it, I would love to do for Esther. You know what I'm saying? Like, throw, like even if we were to invest in the Fall Fest and then make it bigger than what it is. That's a fact. I, w- I would love to do something like that. The biggest takeaways from this was yeah. the Hot Boys reunion. Yeah. And all of them was there. Yeah. You that's watched a it? fact. You watched it? I saw a clip of it. Well, I saw a 15-minute video. Okay. Yeah, probably that, 30. That's, probably yeah. 30. Yeah, because yeah. I, I saw a video that was 15 minutes, another one that was 25, and another one yeah. that was like 30. Yeah, but I saw so, him about 30 minutes. Okay, okay. Did you enjoy it? Trav, I loved it. Okay. I ain't even going to lie to you. Talk about it. I got to work this morning, um, yeah. and I was scrolling on uh, YouTube. I saw it. I clicked on it. I'm driving my truck. If I'm lying, let me drop there right now. I started God dang, crying, man. Trav. You got to do all that. God I started dang. crying, Trav. Holy crap. If I'm lying, let me drop there right now. Dang. That's I started what's up. crying. That's what's I'm up. in my truck, like. <laughs> I thought, well, so. I wasn't boo-hoo, no, no, hugging get, myself, yeah, crying, yeah, no, but yeah, you, yeah. Te- tears rolled yeah. down my eye. Yeah. And it was when... You shed a tear, is what you was saying. I shed a couple of them. Yeah, my eyes okay. Was red. Oh, okay. Whenever um they started doing the... Because I think they performed on fire first, I think. I'm not sure. Yeah. And then uh Wayne... Well, M- Manny Fresh came out and then Wayne and then uh, BG. When I saw BG and Wayne side by side, yeah. dog. That was when they started them, going. Them tears started. No, t- I wasn't crying. crying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? I but I, saying yeah, yeah, I did share a tear. But for me, that was the, the biggest thing in the world. Mm, yeah, biggest yeah. the Super Bowl. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> to me, that was the biggest yeah. thing in the world because I grew up. On hot boys, I grew up on yeah. Cash Money, dog. Yeah. So I was my throat was was, was hurting. <laughs> go ahead, though. Go but ahead. But Turk was there too, right? Yeah, Turk was there. Shout yeah. out to Turk, man. Because that he was the uh, the missing link last time that Lil Wayne didn't perform at um wherever that was. Wherever it was, yeah, I don't even know about that. One. Yeah, we we talked about it before when I asked you who was. Yeah, the, yeah, and, yeah, and, yeah, 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 yeah. So uh, my question, right? Yeah, dog. <laughs> All right, I'm going to ask you personally. Go ahead, ask me personally. If this was Lil Wayne's plan for the Super Bowl, would that have affected the way you felt about the Super Bowl? It would have been the greatest Super Bowl performance (laughs) ever. (laughs) I'm dead serious. Yeah, no, I'm with you. I'm with you. Because at one point, I didn't like rap music at all. Mm -hmm. And then I heard Wayne. Yeah. And then I heard Juvenile. Okay. And then I heard the... Hot boy, yeah, in the big times, and that what made me like rap music. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was in my uh phone and I saw saw them performing. So between the uh, tears, mm-hmm. I did a screenshot a photo, and to me, call me what y'all want, America. <laughs> To me, them boys is bigger than the freaking Beatles. It's, it's bigger than the Moon Landing. It's bigger than Barack being president. Yeah, this, this was. <laughs> To me, yeah, yeah, one of those iconic moments for dog, you. Yeah, I dog when, 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 when I, I, I freaking screenshot an image and I was like, I'm gonna throw it on the podcast. Mm. That is how big it was. Yeah, dog. and I ain't cried in a while, Trey. <laughs> I shed tears, dog. Yeah, and then yeah. they were smiling. And yeah, yeah, yeah. Up. Yeah, it looked like all of them was up there really enjoying the uh, moment. You know what I'm saying? That's what I really wanted, though. I didn't want them to be up there doing it just to do it. I wanted them to be up there enjoying the moment. You they know what I'm saying? Enjoying that, man. And yeah. I was enjoying it too, dog. And, and I said I would never pay a thousand dollars to mm. go meet a you you know rapper. Yeah. If I had the money and I knew it, it was that kind of thing. Yeah. You, if it, it wouldn't hurt me, yeah, I would have. But I wouldn't want to be backstage or on the stage. You I just wouldn't want to be wanna, front row. Yeah. So it I just can uh, see, it, see it and enjoy it. Yeah. That was that mess was was. Dog. Yeah, to I me, think that was epic. Yeah, I think it was a historic moment for sure. That's a fact. Man. And um, yeah. So the reason that I bring that up is what made me think that he planned on doing something like that at the Super Bowl was him saying what he said. Uh, and let's see. All right, I think I'm a little too far ahead, and I don't see the little thing where I could take it back. Let's see. Oh yeah. Bro. 
Yeah. Most. I was able to give, you know, guess who made it that year? The Saints. Okay. They chopped up the curse words. I was words. able to give my mama that sweet. She was able to bring my family and other people from New Orleans, and they had a ball. That moment I said to myself, I want to be on stage for the Super Bowl one day in front of my mom. And I worked my off to get that position, and it was ripped away from me. But this mother moment right here. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, I'm going to let him finish. They can't take that, man. They can't take that from me. Ladies and gentlemen, make some noise for yourself for being amazing. And then what do you go to? Music. Yeah. I think that was a statement to go into Mr. Carter. But that's what made me think that his plan was a hot boy reunion for the Super Bowl. Yeah, that what it sounded like. I ain't even thought about it until yeah. he said it. Yeah, yeah, like it, it, the fact that he said this moment here, which made me think, okay, he was thinking that when he get the Super Bowl performance, that was what he was yeah, gonna make was the gonna moment be. Yeah. But uh, yeah, then he went into Mr. Carter with uh Jay Z on it. Yeah, I know. Right? Yeah, it was like throwing a little yeah, jab was, real yeah, quick just to say, hey, you, you you know you was part of this reason. But anyway. Yeah. Shout out to Wayne, man. Yeah, shout out to Wayne. I will say that, but uh, I saw like performance, like he, cause he did some solo stuff too. Yeah, you yeah. saw some of that or no? Yeah, yeah, I saw a couple. And of yeah, I saw a lot of critiques about it, saying like Kendrick uh, is a better performer, like uh, solo. Yeah, and that's why they feel like he he got it over Wayne. Go ahead. So um, I saw a lot of Wayne um, performances, mm -hmm. and. Stop me whenever you disagree. Mm -hmm. From what I saw of him, he is outside of niggas flying from the ceiling True. And, and, and people hang gliding and stuff. Yeah, he, yeah, yeah. His, his, his performance is top tier. Yeah, I, I've seen him be energetic and performing and hopping around and whatever. Yeah. But I think that, um, because I know weeks ago or months uh, months ago however long it was where Kendrick got announced as the Super Bowl performance and they was posting videos of uh, Lil Wayne performing and I was looking at the videos and it wasn't good videos yeah, of Lil yeah, Wayne performing I and I was like that. people so went and seek went yeah. to seek those out to that's put fact. those out there but I've seen him perform really well that's a fact I've and seen him perform energetically and it's entertaining I, I do think that those were people that either weren't fans of Wayne or were Kendrick super fans pro cause, Kendrick yeah cause they got LeBron in the GOAT conversation I can pull up a, 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 I can make a reel of LeBron and he would look like low a lights. six year old yeah if you him. pull up low you lights yeah. saying? So, <laughs> and I did check the comments on one video and they were um they showed whenever Master P was uh, talking to him in the face he was making it then. They was like, he on drugs and what and whatnot. But it's not like, if you, if you, once you reach a certain status, right, mm -hmm. everything you do got to be perfect. Yeah. Because it's going to be. It's going to be under a microscope. Yeah. yeah. And it's <laughs> like, right now, me, I'm nobody. Yeah. People can take stuff from my life and mm -hmm. my past and prove me to be a no no nobody at the same time people can take stuff from my life Facts. and my past yeah. and i would look like a great person yeah yeah that's true uh, one person said that um they don't even know why uh wayne feel upset he's not even in the top 50 greatest rappers of all time Dang. and that was the comment that had the most likes on it oh for real yeah so it's just like you know it, it's one of those things yeah yeah i've seen wayne perform at his peak mm -hmm. you can listen to his the, the, his music his catalog he got more music he 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 got more energy on his music than kendrick got performing mm. if we, we being honest mm. his music videos he got more energy than, than kendrick got on his best day mm. if we being honest mm. and i said i don't blame them for picking kendrick yeah because yeah, yeah. he had the best year but you know they're not gonna year. care about that part I know, but <laughs> what I'm saying is, yeah, hey, I, I call it spade a spade. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If we talking about performances, Wayne is, is top tier. Gotcha. From what I've seen of Kendrick, he's not. Whenever, no, he up there. Whenever I see people talking about Kendrick, yeah. all they do do is, man, that's it. <laughs> that's the only thing I saw. I yeah. don't know what else he do, but everybody is just, just doing that. 
<laughs> One little yeah. move there. Yeah. Get yeah. what I'm saying? But from what I know of Wayne, it's freaking top tier. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. That's what I'm saying. Uh, I think, and I, I'm not a big fan of Kendrick, but I've seen him put his own uh, ideas and effort into his performances. So I will say his performances are g- good. Yeah. Usually when I see it. But yeah. I'm not a big fan like that either. So I, but yeah. I think I've seen more of his performances than you have to where probably we can so. you know talk about it like yeah. that. So Yeah, probably so, man. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, them boys getting on the stage together, Trey. Yeah. That yeah. made Hot my Boys Reunion. Day, Fire. That made my freaking day, dog. Yeah. Whenever... Um, yeah, let me tell y'all about Chuck for a second. Oh, Lord. I met Chuck, and we would talk about music. Mm-hmm. And when we get to talking about music, yeah. I think he only gave two people credit. Who was that? <laughs> it was Lil Wayne, yep. and I feel like it was somebody else that I can't. It was, Joel Santana. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Santana. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And anytime we bring up any other artist, he'd call them trash or say they whack or whatever like that. At some point, Chuck finally grew up and was like, you know what? You ain't had to say go ahead, go ahead though. God, dog. Such and such wasn't that bad. Or such and such was yeah. all right. <laughs> it, but, it, it took it took a while. Yeah, man. yeah. But the fact that th- th- that's why I knew that this moment for you would be huge. Because I'm a fan of Lil Wayne, but I ain't a fan like you a fan yeah. of Lil Wayne. I sure and, is, man. Yeah, yeah. I like I like to see it and, and, and I appreciated it. But I knew for you it would mean something totally different. So check it out, right? What made me like Wayne, right? Mm-hmm. I was probably ten or eleven, and I could have been eight or nine. I ain't sure. Yeah. But I saw the uh, music video, uh, "The Block Is Hot," mm. and I saw Wayne. At that point, I didn't like music at all, and I was like, "That dude look young." And at that point, he reminded me of my older brother, Cena. Mm. And at that point. My only role role models, the only people that I wanted to grow up and be like, yeah, was my older brother Cini mm. and my father. Gotcha. And me and Cini, we we never talked as much as I would have wanted to. Mm-hmm. We never hung out as much as I would have wanted to. Okay. So I guess I was searching for his love and support. Yeah, the through, validation through part. Wayne. Yeah, yeah. And. I feel like Wayne never disappointed me when it came to the music. So yeah. he was my older brother in a sense. Yeah, and Cini did like Wayne, so I figured, hey, I can give Wayne my energy. Mm-hmm. I can love him, but at the same time, I'm trying to seek the love from my brother. Mm. That's deep. yeah, what I'm saying. Yeah. So you know. Yeah, me, that love came from more of a brotherly thing. Yeah. Because I was searching for love for my older brother. Right, right. And right. I didn't, you know, it did, didn't, Uh, I felt like it could have been more, I felt like my older brother could have done more. Mm, you get what I'm that's saying? As an older so, brother. Yeah. yeah, so as I'm reaching for my older brother, and he's not reaching back as much. Mm-hmm. Wayne reminded me of my Your older, older brother, brother. Yeah. so then I, you know, started reaching for 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 Wayne. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's um. That's why I, I became. That's why I think Wayne the best rapper because when I first saw him, he reminded me of my older brother, mm-hmm. and I was trying to be like my older brother. Gotcha, so. gotcha. Shout out to Wayne, man. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. That's the best Wayne album of all time because it's getting emotional. <laughs> <laughs> God, dog. No, go ahead. Dog. Best Wayne album of all time. The best Wayne album of all time wait, to me. Wait, wait, wait. Best Wayne album of all time and best Wayne mixtape of all time. All right. Instead of doing... Okay, I would say the best Wayne album of all time, it got to be the Carter one. Okay. My favorite Wayne album of all time... Okay. ...is either The Block Is Hot, uh, uh, Carter One, or I'm Not A Human Being. My best Wayne mixtape of all time gotta be No Ceilings 2. Cause to me, that's whenever Wayne became the GOAT. Mm. And I stand on that. Okay. Okay, I respect I stand it. on that. Hey, diehard Wayne fans, jump in the comments, let us know what y'all think. And then everybody else, mm-hmm. what did y'all think about the Hot Boys reunion? Fire. What did y'all think about Lil Wayne speaking on the Super Bowl again? 
And uh, yeah, let us know what y'all think is uh, next for here from Lil Wayne. What is next from here for Lil Wayne? That's a fact. <laughs> That's a fact. All right.